to the new health care bill released by the GOP. Some saying it's a step in the right direction, while others worried about their future. 10 News reporter Jessica Chen has the story. Isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's just a part of life for Max. About 10 times a day you check yourself now. His mom, Nikki Fadick, making sure his type 1 diabetes is in check. Which is a good number. Yeah, is a good number. Max was diagnosed when he was six, and there was a time they couldn't get him health coverage. Due to my son's so-called pre-existing condition, we were denied coverage for him and it was terrifying. On Thursday, the GOP releasing their version of the health care bill, saying Obamacare is a direct attack on the American people. They say insurers will need to cover those with pre-existing conditions, but they don't have to cover all of their treatments. It's a little difficult to have any confidence that our needs, the protections that we were afforded, are actually going to be represented in this new bill. Nikki says every new revision to the bill, a new level of uncertainty. I wrongly assumed that that was a benefit we were going to get to enjoy forever. Because all she can think about is what will her son's future look like? It's uncertain and, and, and that's what I resent about it. In Carlsbad, Jessica Chen, 10 News. And 10 News reached out to the Republican Party of San Diego 